Hey guys, I just want to give you a snapshot of my Vintage Road Candles. This came from Vintage Road Candles Company. Um, you can definitely check this company out at www.vintageroadcandles.com. I ordered um, four chunks. These are like mini little chunks of wax. They're two ounces as well as I got a shoddy. So um, I like their packaging. It's very vintage. <laughs> Um, as well as, you know, they give every scent, like a little, whatever the color of the wax is, that's the color of it on the packaging. And they have the pour date and the cure time, which I'm glad that this says September 26, 2017, because that means that this bad boy is ready to melt. Because they do instruct on the little card that they gave me, that you allow for it to cure for two to four weeks from the pour date. So um, that's very important. They sent me um, a priority mailing envelope as well as this card was attached inside with my invoice. So this card just tells you about how to be safe while melting and it has the company's website on there, which I'll show again before the end of my video. So I want to thank you guys for tuning in with Melting with Milton. Um, because the scent shots um, and the chunkies have the scent description on it, I'll show you guys what I have. So I got Charmed, which is like Amber, Jasmine, Cotton Candy, and Candid Limes. I don't have anything like this. I don't really have anything with lime in it. Um, so this right here, I just feel like it's going to be clean, sweet, something really great for like springtime. But I might bust it out now just to see how their melts throw. <sighs> Namaste is just sea breeze, lavender, pepper. This is like a, a relaxing scent. So I could do that now for Christmas um, or, you know, this is year round, which is awesome. And I like the colors of the wax. And I also got this from the same um, scent from Earth Treasure Goddess. So I get to compare and contrast the throws from the two and the mixtures and the blends. I'm sorry for the sniffling. One of my babies is walking around and just, you know, exploring. So nevertheless, that's, that's this one. Chocolate chip mellow cookies is like chocolate brownies, toasted marshmallows, sugar cookie dough. I think it's going to be really good. It's just all the things that anybody could like or want are all in this blend. And I like they had like little chunks in there. And honestly, when I first opened all of these and I sniffed them before, you know, I did a review and I actually got these um, yesterday, I believe. I don't like anything on cold sniff. I'm not really a fan of anything in this but normally I'm like wow and everything everything just smells kind of bland but I'm hoping that the throws are not that way um everybody knows I love Satsuma uh, raspberry fruity loops so it's just basically raspberry sorbet um fruit loops fruity pebbles like a cereal blend I could definitely pick up the fruity pebbles I like fruity pebbles I think they smell amazing and I'm glad that it's not just a fruit loop blend I like the fact that everything that they sent me, I can actually melt without cure time. That may not always be the case, except for these samples, of course. They gave me two samples. So the first sample is strawberry white cake. I mean, there cannot be a problem with white cake. And I want to say it just like Leonardo DiCaprio in um, Django. And he was like, what in heel blazes could be going wrong with, go wrong with white cake? absolutely nothing so i know this is gonna smell really really good and it's a small little um wax so i'll probably cut it in half and check it out remember guys less is more that's what i've learned from my groups because i was heavy-handed at first so this is sleepy hollow it's like lee sweater weather it's, it's more like a some well it's cold out now so this is perfect and i love the fact that it's gray it has like the little glitter so it reminds me of christmas um and last but not least, it is my shoddy. It's frosted coconut vanilla. I just got this because I wanted a scent shot. They were all getting taken. And I was like, hmm, peppermint and coconut? And, you know, I don't have anything like that. So I definitely decided to get it. The shoddies, of course, have the pour date as well as the website. And so do all the little chunks. So if you guys want to take advantage of this, the chunks are normally $2.25 a piece. The wax shot was one ninety five. They're all two ounces. Um, I didn't see anything less than two ounces on their promotion. I got this on November twenty fifth. I ordered it, 
and it actually came yesterday, which was December 6th, I want to, December 7th, I believe. Um, they didn't really have a good sale. Even on Black Friday, they gave me $2.73 <laughs> off of my packaging. The shipping was $7.20. I'm really confused as why it took so long because all the stuff seemed to be poured except for the um, free sample shots. So, that's kind of a long time to get here. I paid $15.42 for all of these plus the shipping. So, I have um, four chunkies and one cent shot. So, that's two ounces a piece. You know, that's 10 ounces of wax plus shipping for $15.42, which is not too bad. I just want to try this company out. And if you do too, visit www.vintagerollcandles.com. Thank you for tuning in with Milton with Milton. Until next time.